Hello, everyone. Hey. Welcome back hey. to a very belated episodes of Zone of the Enders, the second runner. We unlocked some new difficulties when we beat the game. We got very hard from the first game. We got super hard and extreme. Shit. We ain't playing on those, though, because yeah. we're cowards. I mean, I'm not a coward. Don't don't group me with that shit. Even though, like, <laughs> even though, like, I'm the reason, like, we delayed this these episodes for quite a while but because hey. you're an academic coward who puts studies before recording video games yeah let's say that yeah sure um <clears throat> <laughs> so uh we unlocked the ability to play as whatever jehu two we want and with every new playthrough um we can choose what version of jehu T and also um do we want to equip all of our sub weapons and whatnot so we just oh. start with the vector cannon. Oh fuck yeah! <laughs> um, it's sh it's worth noting that naked Jehuti is so strong though that like one or two hits will destroy any boss anyways. Oh, so this is very unnecessary, but oh. it's very fun regardless. Oh, <laughs> and even this is from the beginning still, and it still plays that same cutscene. Nice. Anubis though, you can never beat. He's too powerful. Yeah. So here's the last EX mission you can get. You need to get it on New Game Plus because you need to have Wisp during the Vic Viper fight. It's the only way you can grab it. Oh. Huh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Very easy fight. Yeah, Naked Jehuti should be illegal, to be honest. Like, he's ridiculous. Um, do you remember, probably not because it's been months, but do you remember this dead end? Uh, no, not really, but this is when familiar. we were, this, this is when we were getting like the two shield generators down on yeah. Mars right before yeah, um, yeah. we fought Viola AI. Uh, so now that we have the vector cannon in all of its glory, yeah, you just blow it up. I missed this charge. Yeah. I really missed it. Alright, what's so in there's here? A me there's a Metatron, and that's it. No, there's there's a secret tunnel. Oh. Turbines. <laughs> I'm real hype about this. This is just some weird enemies here. They've been chilling. They've been stuck, yeah. you know? It's like, oh, you feed us, now kill us. <laughs> yeah. They were checking the turbines, making sure that all the Mars renewable energy is good. Yeah. Thanks, Trump. Naked JHT can just spam homing missiles whenever he wants, because infinite energy. It's power 20, 20, 2099 or some shit. I don't, I don't fucking know. Yeah, sure, let's go with that. <laughs> so, this is the real fun. The final boss is just in here. Oh. Yeah. He's just chilling. Is there anything different about this? Kind of? Um, I think he's less aggressive. Which is weird, but... Um, like, the AI plays it a bit differently. And also, he can't do the self heal thing because the weird tiles aren't on the wall. Yeah, okay. Home and mi missiles don't really do much because he blocks them, unfortunately. But as you can see, sub sub weapons uh, are pretty good against them. Uh, seems pretty difficult even with naked Jaguti. Uh, it is, that's because I'm not exploiting the fuck out of his AI and I'm dicking oh, around. Nice. So, like, Halberd, he, he dodges pretty good. But. Whenever I switch over to it. The p angry Pac-Man. Okay, there <laughs> we go. So, Gauntlet just kind of ruins his AI. And, like, he'll dodge it, but after a bit, like, you can just kind of stun lock him. Oh. <laughs> and whittle it down. Oh. And then after that, we unlock a little trophy here. And we got a new mech for versus mode. Oh. Uh, Cool. Yeah. All right. That's not the only versus mech unlockable. Well, first of all, there's this. 
I just wanted to show that naked Jehuti, when uh, she pulls up her shield, um, you can just keep attacking her, and naked Jehuti will just break it eventually. <laughs> Yeah, fuck, like fuck the ability to think in a boss, yeah. you know? Like just do it. Just do the thing. And the SOS mission just becomes a joke because <laughs> just hey, homing missiles. It's it's ridiculous. Like just don't even bother. Why are you even playing the video game at this point, hey, you know? Feels good, dude. Feels yeah. good to play the good robot. So this is, I think, one of the weirdest additions. Um, in the in our favorite room in the whole game, this is just here now. Oh. And it's you unlock Lloyd's Mech for versus mode. Speaking of Lloyd, yeah, he's also a joke. <laughs> Here's a better look at that thing that we kind of accidentally skipped over. You kind of just play red light, green light. And then eventually you just smack him and he's dead too. <laughs> Alright. Good stuff. Yep. Hey, is, if this is your first time watching Zone the Enders 2, and. You did it wrong. <laughs> uh, well, first of all, you did it wrong, but also, hey, ha have, a, have a good look at the abridged version of ZOE 2. Yeah. Uh, there's a very good reason there are separate speedrun categories for each of these. Ah. Uh. This was a good boss. I remember yeah, this boss. Yeah, also you can break through its shield too. <laughs> <laughs> <All right. laughs> Thanks for showing that, as I say, this was a good boss. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let me reminisce a bit more. <laughs> this fight also becomes quite easy. I mean, it's still very easy if you're not paying attention and you're not going around healing to uh, fuck up and get one of your own loves uh, killed, but... yeah. The infinite sub-energy makes this also quite a joke. Now this... You can just shoot in <laughs> New Game Plus. <laughs> oh, and there's God. a hidden area. You telling me JOD couldn't shoot lasers before New Game Plus? No. Okay. So when you play as naked JOT, it just warps you into the next area of the game. Oh. And now, and now we're at that one tunnel, but yeah. if you go here as one of the other versions of Jehuti, such as Damage Jehuti, who also has infinite sub-energy, by the way, so as you get sub-weapons, he actually becomes more powerful than you might think. Uh, we're just gonna have the super boss fight of the game, it's Naked Jehuti. Oh. Cool. And he's fucking powerful. <laughs> Look, we're almost dead. Oh. Cool. Alright. They don't... They, they don't let you fight him as Naked JHT. Like, you have to be one of the three shittier versions. <laughs> you know, that's fine. That's cool. Yeah. I don't mind that. So, this is a rough-ass fight. So, just do this. <laughs> <laughs> Man, what the fuck? And there we go, we unlocked Naked JOT for versus mode. Thanks for me that, cool! Awesome! <laughs> I was ready to be entertained, you know? Yeah. Alright, uh, I have high hopes for this one. Say, say your yeah. thing. So, there, there is one thing I learned from this that I actually never knew, and it's that uh, there are, in fact, three distinct phases of Anubis. Um, which, like, you can kind of see in the actual fight due to, like, um, the animations that play at certain points, but, like, yeah. he actually, like, is invi- like, you can see, like, he's not taking damage there, like, he- as he enters from phase one to phase two to phase three, like, there's just points where, like, right there, you can't damage him. Yeah. And then we just slapped <laughs> him in the face again, that's good. Now this is making up for past mistakes, in my opinion. So if you- <laughs> if you go all the way at the end of here, you can pull this out, and we can get the real final shot in Anubis. <laughs> Worth it. Yep. Good Worth stuff. Worth it, I tell ya.
That was worth another playthrough, yeah. Yes, it was. Good yes, stuff. it was. So here's the versus mode. We can't use the pro controls in versus mode. I also don't have a friend to play the versus mode with, and there's no online, so I'm fighting the CPU. <laughs> Uh, it's better than Zone of the Enders 1's versus mode, which we saw that one time. Also, like, each of the orbital frames are, like, not just the basic enemies, but bosses. So that's kind of neat. Oh. Let's go, uh, we got a little bit of a throwback to the first game here. It's the Antilia colony for our versus stage. Simulator activated. Oh, this stage. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Cool. All so right. We're, we're righting Anubis' wrong by killing Jehuti. When we should have. <laughs> the CPU is actually pretty decent at like ranging and keeping you away and stuff when it wants to, but Anubis can teleport, so. Hey, so EVO 2019 hasn't announced its lineup yet, so cross your fingers for ZOE 2 versus mode and yeah, the lineup. I, personally, I think that this is going to be the fifth series that crosses over with uh, Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle. Yeah, you think so? Yeah, and also these are going to be two scale, so you're just going to see like the little stubs of the feet, <laughs> and, and like it's just going to take up like half the screen. All and right, you're just going to have to deal with it. All right, I'm down with that. I'm ready to play uh, Ragna Jaihuti. Hell yeah. <clears throat> so one thing that is like everyone who isn't Jehuti or Anubis plays fucking weird. Let's begin. How so? Um. Let's go, just yeah. like because it's so obvious their attacks were meant to be boss attacks in a video game and not something that you have to like input like just the wind up and cooldown feels bad on like all of their attacks and stuff uh, or like even even this like the burst attack I was doing with the Nubis there like it, it's so delayed and feels not like something a player character should be doing <laughs> it's it's really goofy yeah like like look at that delay time it's just weird this is the turbine uh, stage area thing that we were just in. Yeah. It's kind of weird that this is a versus map, but whatever. Did I overestimate? Yes. <laughs> but yeah, this is a cool thing. Um, I have played this with a friend one time in my life before, and we had fun. But it's it's busted as hell, and like. I, I do know that there are places on the internet you can go to, like, actually look at competitive meta for this, and it's Let's busted and broken in all hell, as all hell. Um, this is not balanced whatsoever. Good. Those are the best games. Yes. Also, I really hate when, even when you're fighting against the computer, sometimes it's like, no, you have to be on the far end of, yeah, the, yeah, of the camera thing. <laughs> yeah, this camera was not meant for two-player. That's for sure. No, was not. <laughs> and like, you could even see this in like the the first game's versus mode, but like, yeah, like it's still bad here. And like, it's awkward too, like to denote like, oh, you're close. They just like cover up the middle of the screen like that with yeah. the close marker. I hate it. <laughs> yeah, with Lloyd's like lack of like darkness or like interesting mechanics, he's kind of just land yeah, to, to <laughs> like he's not super fun he looks he can use decoys but that's about it he looks cool so if you like looking cool yeah play lloyd's play lloyd's robot we got enough this against naked jehuti as you might imagine naked jehuti one of the better fighters <laughs> better or just best uh, not best. Oh, Let's shit. And we'll kind of see why in the next match. Okay. But also, it's it's kind of... I'll explain when we get there. Simulator activated. So, we just have the charge ability. When, like, she used to, like, ram us, and we had to, like, get a shield to block it. Yeah. We can just do that now, <laughs> and it's pretty good. Except when he zones out like that, but... Neftis is rad. And, like, if you look at the hit, like, on those, like, giant spirit bomb, like, burst attacks, yeah. like, the hitbox is ridiculous. Like, I'm, I'm constantly like, oh, I'm safe, and then I, it turns out I'm not. Nope. <laughs> 
I think the idea is like, oh, if you let them charge up in the first place, you're playing wrong, but whatever. And yeah, we can use the weird ring to do damage and shit too. I love that dodge so much. <laughs> There is like, there's no rounds either. Holy shit! Like, nope. You can nope. you just can won. just die in this versus mode. Wow. I love All right. it. Yes. Hell yeah. So I I kind of broke from the order of just playing as all the bottom row fighters so I could show off Vic Viper properly. Leo coming. Vic Viper is fucking ridiculous. I shall take care um. Arjet just happens to be really good at, like, dealing with his shit. Simulator activated. But unlike all the other, uh, characters which have a sub-weapon, um, you'll see Vic Viper's gimmick in a second here. It's exactly what you think it is, probably. But yeah, those, those wisps that fly around are a big pain in the ass. Oh, well, at least she can do some here. Yeah. All right, Rawson, when are you going to do the thing? I'm doing the thing. Oh, so hell yes. So this is just the fastest character, and it's just dumb. <laughs> it, it just happens to be that the Wisps are also really fast and good at tracking. But against any other fighter, as soon as you activate this Vic Viper mode, they just don't know what to do. <laughs> it's ridiculous. So yeah, instead of instead of building up to use your your traditional um, your traditional like sub weapon or whatever, when you play as Vic Viper, you build up to get your transformation. Going. Oh, okay, that's nice. Yeah. Yeah, and as you can see, like his gauge is refilling on his own, so or on its own rather. Yeah. Yeah. It's neat. It's neat. You don't get the options though, right? No, yeah. that would be absurd. Yeah, but I would like that. It'd be fun. Patching in Konami. Or settings. <laughs> this is a close fight though. It's almost like I had to record this like two times because <laughs> I lost the first time or something. <laughs> Just keep the footage of you losing. No, I'm a coward. Alright. Yeah, I guess so.